we are now going to fire off 10 shots from an unmodified Nerf Raven. Our short range ended up being about 30 feet, while our long, longest shot ended up, as you can see, about 45 feet. Now let's see what we can do for modifications. Okay, we are here now to modify the Nerf Raven gun, give it a little bit more firepower, and to modify the Nerf Raven gun, all you'll need is four pieces of wire, about four inches, two nine volt battery, and some electrical tape. So to begin, we simply take off the battery case, remove the existing stock 1.5 AA batteries because they will no longer be necessary. Set those aside. Take one of your 9 volt batteries and a piece of electric tape. Get one of your pieces of wire and lay it across the positive terminal, taping your battery. Tipping the wire to the side of the battery securely. This just keeps the wire in place. And then you want to push the wire so that it touches the positive side of the battery. Kind of push it down with the end of your screwdriver so that it makes a really good connection. Okay, once we got the connection done there, we're all set. Repeat that same process with the other 9 volt battery. Make sure we get a good connection because that's important when we go to shoot. So we do the same process all over again with the second 9 volt. This will be this this gun will be running 18 volts. Gun that was designed to run on 6 volts. We're going to run it on 18 volts. So you just take the other battery, put the wire again on the positive side of the 9 volt, tape the battery just to hold the wire in place. And then make sure your wire is firmly connected to the positive side of the battery. Okay, now we have two 9 volts that are connected to the positive side. And we're ready to insert them in the gun. Take your first 9 volt and wedge it in the far left double A battery compartment making sure that the negative end of the 9 volt is touching the spring section of the battery. Now you're going to want to take the other end of the wire and insert it, kind of loop it around so you have enough wire to push in on the positive side Okay, and then just insert that into the positive side of the old double A area. Okay, and then you're going to take the other 9 volt and do the same thing. Wedge it in the negative contact touching 
wedge it in the far right battery compartment and again take the wire loop it around and insert it into the positive end okay now that's all that's left to do is to bypass the other two battery cells for that we use these two small pieces of wire and simply push the one up in the spring and set the other end down on the other lead take the next wire insert it in the spring dent and we now have a 18 volt modified Nerf Raven let's test fire it now we're now going to run a test fire of 10 bullets on the modified Nerf Raven. Okay, now to see the distance. On the short range, we ended up right around 50 to 51 feet. That was the shortest range. Several at 60, one at 65 another at 65, quite a few at the 70 foot range, one at the 76 foot range. If we go all the way out to where the other one is, landed in the bushes right here, and we go straight over right about 92 feet. 92 feet for the furthest shot of the modified Nerf Raven. That about doubles our distance with a simple modification.